Hello, welcome back. Today I would like to update a video on check rent. So finally, you can jailbreak your iPhone running on iOS 13.4 on Windows. So all you have to do, you need RAN USB and then check rent version 0.10, which is a experiment version. So for RAN USB, it doesn't support with iOS 13.4 yet, but we can modify it and get it support to version 13.4. So all you have to do, you need these two files, and the link can be found in description. You can download from my um, description. And for the USB, you will need at least 15 gigabyte of USB. And for me, I don't have USB. You can also use you can also use SD card as well. I have 64 gig SD card, and I can plug it into card reader, and then we can trick and make it um, like USB, so you can run it. But if you plug in your SD card directly into your computer, it doesn't work. So make sure you have a card reader. And then you can plug it into your PC and we can create a bootable USB. After the USB is plugged in, you can run Balana software. So make sure you run it as administrator. You can see Balana software pop up here. All you have to do, click on select image, which is you can choose um, RAN USB. So for me, I'm Select it from the desktop because my file is on the desktop. And then you can click on open. And then you can select your SD card, but it will um, identify automatically, so you don't need to select it. And then you can click on flash finally. But for me, I have already did that. And after you create a bootable USB, you can go to Transmac. And Transmac, the link can be found in description as well. And make sure you run it as administrator as well. And now you can take a look on the left side. You can see your USB, click on it. And then you can see RAN USB, click on RAN USB folder, click on application. And here is check RAN the old version. So we need to replace it with the new version. So it will support on iOS 13.4. I'm gonna replace it on 0.9.6. I can double click on it. And now on contents. And now on contents, you need to delete. So click on delete it. And we can transfer the new one into it. So you can open this folder from desktop, which is um, we have downloaded before. And then you can open the folder and make sure you drag and drop this folder into the USB. And now it is copy. And all you have to do after that, you just restart your computer. So I'm going to restart my computer. As soon as you see this logo, you will need to click on escape key to go into BIOS. If you have different computer, you will need to find um, the key into BIOS. And then you can click on F9 to go boot device option. And then you can boot either two ways. So you can directly boot from hard drive, which is um, your USB. And you can boot from EFI file. So I'm going to boot from my EFI file. And I can click on enter. Click, click on enter again. And I can use my arrow down to go to EFI folder. Go to Clover. And then at the bottom, you will see Clover H64. And then hit on Enter. And you should be able to see this page. Use your arrow left. And then you can boot um, from RAN USB. Click on Enter.
now you should see Ren USB logo. And for those of you who having issues on trackpad and it, it doesn't click, you need to manually connect your USB mouse into your computer and then you should be able to click. So, and then you can click on utility, go to terminal, and then you should see terminal page. So all you have to do, type number six, and then hit on enter key, and check then should pop up, and, and you can see version 0 0.10 here. So it does support on iOS 13.4. And now you can connect your iPhone into your computer. And for me, I have the iPhone 8 running on iOS 13.4. And now I can connect it into the computer. After that, you should be able to see the phone is recognized by the computer. And you can use your arrow key. And now I can click on Start. And I can hit on Next. And then my phone should put into recovery mode. And now you can hit on start and you will need to hold on volume down and power button at the same time and then you will need to release the power button but you can keep holding on volume down button to put into DFU mode and then your phone should be able to jailbreak. So now hit on start. And it is booting, so you just wait a little bit, and you can see check run logo on here. Now everything is done, so you can disconnect your phone. And now let's go to my iPhone home screen. So you can go to check that and make sure your iPhone is connected to Wi-Fi. And then you can click on side here and then click on install side here. But for me, I have already installed side here. That's why it's so reinstalled. I don't have to do that. And you can see side here on my phone. It is working perfectly fine. And at the bottom, it is running on iOS 13.4. You can see here. And finally, I would like to thank to check that team who worked very hard on check that app. And I would like to say thank you for RAN USB. He also made the RAN USB and you can use it on Windows. So it is support on Windows. This is the modified version of RAN USB. And as you can see at the beginning, I have to manually replace the file in order to get it to work. And finally, thanks for watching. I hope you like this video. And then I will catch you guys in the next one.